it. Perfect. It only counts if it's perfect. Yes. Yad is human, just like you. No, he's an angel. So his pledge counts and yours doesn't? That's right. Mine isn't perfect. I can't count it yet. Yad counted it. I can't count it. difference between the worth you assign a skill and the worth of that skill. So the skills I value are valuable, and that's what matters? What is this? A world of nothing? A world with nobody in it? This is the world of perfection and freedom. Perfection and freedom? A world where you're free to see all the perfect planches you want. Is this really is this freedom? freedom? Yes, yes, this is what it is. However, However you must you will must these planches into existence. I have to think of the perfect planch? Yes, you must envision yourself doing the perfect planch. I don't know exactly what it would look like. He cannot create a perfect planch because it doesn't exist. Perfection is the illusion. This is a world is where a you could see yourself see in a perfect pledge. pledge. But you can't you envision can't perfection, envision. Can, you? can you? Don't you know what the perfect pledge looks like? I, I know the cues, straight arms, straight hollow body, body shoulder, shoulder protraction. Let's give you one measure. Your pledge must be horizontal like this line. You've gained a standard of which to measure a pledge, but you've lost a degree of freedom. Now, if a pledge is not horizontal, it is not a pledge. You feel easier now, don't you? You have less trouble on your mind. Perfection is so many details, it's impossible to achieve them all. By keeping things simple, you can exist with any planch. You can change what skills are valuable to you as well. What skills you might have valued yesterday may not be important to you today. This is the shape of your rea- What the f*** that? S sorry, my mind started wandering. When there are others, I can perceive my skill set as an individual. By recognizing the difference between your own attributes and others, you establish your own identity in the calisthenics world. With a new understanding, you can decide whether to count your plunge. I don't count it. Yard counted it. Maybe one day I will count it. That's right. If I train hard enough, I may count it one day too. And if I decide to focus on other skills, that's also okay. I'm not defined by my skills. The drive to work toward my goals is what defines me. Oh, <laughs> 